We see modest inflationary pressures across our business, but if you take the cost base as a whole, we are much closer to the previous cycle trough than we are to the previous cycle peak. But we do see some pockets of stronger pressure in Minerals Australia, whether that is for bespoke skills or extra turnover in some aspects of our labour hire business. But overall, you can see that mining wages are growing at about 2.3% right now, which is exactly the same as the national average in Australia. Each of our regional businesses, Minerals Australia, Minerals Americas and Petroleum, have exited their cost troughs. The uncontrollable costs that impact our business, we've actually seen prices there leveling off after relatively steep gains uh, in the previous couple of years. In terms of where we see costs going into the medium or longer term, we look at various utilisation rates across key aspects of our, of our procurement business. So when we look at truck deliveries, for instance, we look at utilisation of deep water petroleum equipment, we think we're tracking about 50% of the previous peak. When we look at the forward capex pipeline in Australia across all mining industries, we actually think we're going to get to about half of the peak run rate, which we achieved in the previous cycle. So all of that to us says that the kind of utilisation rates or pressures on resources that were seen in the last cycle are not evident this time. So we don't think that it's plausible to say that the cost base will return to where it was in that FY11, FY12 peak. We are going to see some inflation, but it will be certainly modest by historical standards if your benchmark is the cycle before this one.